There is no doubt about it. Winter has no intention of giving up, quite the opposite. It will reassert itself, attempting to make the weather at the end of February extremely intense. While some are already dreaming of an early spring, the atmospheric reality tells a completely different story. The cold air will attempt a decisive strike and based on the latest forecasts, this move may succeed. The prediction models clearly indicate a tangible effort from the cold to impose itself on the European stage, bringing with it consequences that are far from trivial. In recent days, there has been a discussion about the dynamics related to the polar vortex, whose development plays a key role in the climatic structure of the Northern Hemisphere. Despite attempts to maintain a certain degree of coherence, signs of weakness are becoming increasingly apparent. There will be no so-called split, meaning no fragmentation into several parts, but its weakening could trigger significant effects. In fact, when its structure loses strength, the atmospheric balance is tested, opening the door for zonal exchanges capable of sending frozen air masses southward. The first to feel the impacts will be Eastern European countries, where they will experience a sharp drop in temperatures in just a few days. Siberian air will flow in strongly, bringing with it heavy snowfall, freezing winds and midwinter conditions. In those areas, we will once again talk about extremely cold temperatures, with values potentially reaching their lowest recorded levels. And this is not just speculation, but a progressively tangible hypothesis based on weather models describing a rare cold wave for February. We rarely witness such a cold wave at our latitudes, and if it occurs, it could bring us days of real winter, with scenarios much more suited to northern latitudes.